instead of lecturing about the different kinds of points of concurrency for triangles, I decided to let my students explore a bit using a program called GeoGebra. It comes uh, web-based. It also has an app that is downloadable for iPad. Um, it also has a Chrome uh, extension that you can add uh, to the Chrome browser if you want to use that as well. I started by recording some videos of GeoGebra in action and asked my students to perform the same activities that I did. It was an easy way to introduce them to the different tools, the different features, and allowed them to do some exploration while having a guide on the side. They had the ability to, uh, I paired them up and one, one of the partners would have the video playing and would be the person who would pause, rewind, and help direct what to do. And then the other person would actually do the first activities um, on, on the iPad itself. To record this, what I was doing on the screen, I used a program called Camtasia, which allows me to uh, record whatever's on the screen in voiceover uh, as I'm talking through the process. Once I'd produced the videos, I uploaded them to my YouTube channel and published them, making them, making them public. To make them accessible to my students, I added them to my calendar so it was just a link away. GeoGebra is a great resource for... My students were on task and were engaged. Um, they were very helpful with one another. Um, look forward to the lesson, I think. They look forward to the second day of it as well. And hopefully they learned a lot more than, than they would have passively taking notes. Yeah. What do you do with Shandy Algebra?